Blockchains hold the potential to revolutionize every single aspect of our online lives. Anyone who has gotten close to this technology realizes this potential. And so far, most of the adoption of blockchain technology has been inside the cryptocurrency space with DeFi, NFTs. But when will we see a killer blockchain application that has nothing to do with financial speculation? Well, that moment could be now. And in this video, I wanna talk about one blockchain application in particular that could fit this description. It just saw a massive surge in new users in the past week. Everybody's talking about it online. And I'm particularly excited about this because it has nothing to do with cryptocurrency. And in this video, I'm gonna tell you exactly what it is and why you need to pay attention if you're trying to stay two steps ahead in this space. And also with this comes a big opportunity for blockchain developers. So make sure you watch until the end of this video. So if you're new around here, you know, hey, I'm Gregory. And on this channel, I turn you into a blockchain master. So if that's something you're interested in, then smash that like button down below for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe to this channel. And if you want to get ahead of this next explosive crypto wave, then the best way to do that is to double down on your technical skills and become a blockchain developer. And I can show you how to do that step by step from start to finish over at dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp. All right, so let's get into this. Let's look at this killer blockchain application that doesn't even use crypto that's making a big buzz online. So what is it? Well, it's called Farcaster, which is a Web 3.0 social media platform. And it recently saw a 400% surge in user activity with the release of its new frames feature. So, you know, what's the big deal here? Why is this happening? Why are we seeing such a huge influx? And where could this potentially go? So first, let's talk about what is Farcaster. So I originally made a video about this in my channel in the summer of 2023, talking about Farcaster when I first started using it. And that was a game changer for Web 3.0 social media. And I'll briefly summarize some of the points I made in that video so that you have to, have to watch the whole thing. So Farcaster is a Web 3.0 social media app where you can post content a lot like Twitter or X.com. You know, they refer to themselves as a sufficiently decentralized social network. So basically, it's an open blockchain protocol where anybody can publish social media in a decentralized way to get the benefits of Web 3.0, like censorship resistance, trustlessness, and transparency, among other things. Because everybody knows that social media has problems like deplatforming, shadow banning, and censorship. And also, nobody knows how the algorithms work. They're complete black boxes that can, you know, suppress anything that they want to, or, you know, show anything that they want to make important, which can have a huge effect on our, you know, mental well-being. And so that's kind of the problem that Farcaster solves. But how does it actually use blockchain and what's that user experience like? Well, basically, users can sign up for Farcaster with a crypto wallet on their phone uh, with a bunch of different apps, which I'll talk about here in a minute, and then start posting content, you know, using blockchain technology without having to actually even use cryptocurrency. And that's the thing I'm really excited about is that you don't even have to be interested in like Bitcoin you don't even have to be interested in holding cryptocurrency to get rich, which means that this has an audience of other people that currently are not being attracted to crypto and a much larger total addressable market because almost everybody uses social networks. So it's got wide scale adoption potential. And so ever since I made the video about Farcash for last summer, it's seen a steady stream of activity of daily active users with some modest growth during that time, but it's recently seen hockey stick growth, okay? Like boom, out of nowhere overnight. The platform grew by 400% in daily active users. So why is that? Well, this comes with the release of Farcaster's new frames feature, which is the most innovative blockchain-based feature that I've seen across any of these types of social networks. You know, it sets Farcaster apart from other blockchain-based social applications like Lens or Friend.tech. So what is the frame feature? What does it do? Why is it such a big deal? So basically what Frames does is it lets you turn any cast into an interactive app. So what does that mean? So casts are like anything that you post on Farcaster, okay? So like if you're on Twitter, you know, you make a post or a tweet, all right? That, uh, that post or tweet is like a, as a cast on Farcaster. And just like any other social network, you know, your post could be text, it could be an image, it could be a video, it could be a poll. But what frames are, is it lets you actually create an app as your social media posts. So developers can create any type of apps they want to that can run inside this container as a standalone post. And so that has pretty much unlimited opportunities associated with it for what you could even do. But for now, some of the early types of adoption we're seeing, especially in the crypto space, are people are letting you do things like mint NFTs straight inside of a post, you know, buying a coin. And even outside the crypto space, again, which is what I'm most excited about, you can do things like have checkout links for e-commerce 
you know, straight inside of a post where they don't have to leave the platform to buy a product or so many other things. You know, you're only limited by your imagination and what's actually feasibly possible as a developer. So why is this such a big deal? Well, number one, it's a really innovative social media primitive that I don't see happening anywhere, whether it's using blockchain technology or not using blockchain technology. And it basically eliminates the need for anyone to switch platforms to, you know, make a transaction, which eliminates a lot of the friction for the end user. And it completely just opens the box for what's even possible with social media. Again, like I was saying before, you're pretty much only limited by your imagination and what you can feasibly accomplish as a developer with that footprint. And you might think, well, but you can have like a buy now button on Facebook or an Instagram post or something like that. Well, again, you have to remember because this is blockchain based, it's censorship resistant. So that's completely different from these other social media platforms, which are really going to limit what you could do with that type of thing. You have to get it approved by these platforms. There's all this type of red tape with centralized oversight, but not here. And another reason this is such a huge deal is that it implements a user experience that's far superior to other social platforms that have tried to implement this type of thing. And one area where blockchain is doing this most so much better. So let's say a lot of these frames are used for more financial transactions. Well, if you have a crypto wallet already set up when you're using the app, it's as simple as signing a transaction with your private key in order to facilitate that. And so if you want to see just a really test example of like a proof of concept for a frame, you can see that. So basically like here's, they did one for Girl Scout cookies, you know, something that's really uh, uh, an impulse buy, I would say. Basically, you can just list the product straight inside of a social media post and have the checkout link on you know, embedded within the post and buy completely inside the application without ever having to leave the app. All right, so if you want to actually download Farcaster today and start using it, again, this is not a sponsor video. This is just something that I'm watching happen and I always like to educate people on what's you know trending inside the crypto space and where everything is headed. Uh, how can you do that, okay? Well, there's several different clients for Farcaster and that's what I want to stress. It's really Farcaster is a protocol. It's a blockchain-based protocol. And anybody theoretically can write an application that uses that protocol. Now, what you can do is you can use the most popular application for this on your mobile platform, whether it's you know iOS or Android, which is called Warpcast. Okay. You can just download Warpcast. It's gonna walk you through setting up your wallet, all right, which is a pretty fast and nice onboarding experience. If you want to see, like, hey, you know, crypto has a huge UX problem, which, you know, people are like, how do I even use this thing when I get started? Farcash has made that really easy. And you're going to see that if you walk through the steps. So just download the app, set it up. You don't need any cryptocurrency to get started. Definitely check it out. And you can follow me at Dapp University on Farcaster to go ahead and start building your network. All right. So at the beginning of this video, I said there was going to be a big opportunity for developers with this. And that's exactly what we're seeing with Farcaster frames. Okay. So, you know, how is there an opportunity here? Well, one of the biggest challenges for developers is sort of making a name for yourself, whether you're trying to, you know, get your foot in the door to land your first job, or maybe ascend the ranks inside the web 3.0 space. Um, you know, whatever your goal is, you know, having some type of portfolio or work that you can point to is key. All right. And this is where I think this is a huge opportunity for developers is basically where you can create a real project and put it out there that other people can use that shows that you understand blockchain. And this is a really good example. So the frames from what I can see are not that hard in the grand scheme of things to create. Again, I've not personally done one yet, but this is a good opportunity to check out. And so the reason I say this is like whenever some developers want to create a real world project that other people can use, sometimes they get limited to thinking, you know, this massive scale application that's really hard to create. But if you can create something that's much smaller, more condensed and manageable and put it out there and actually get some traction, it's made more likely that you're actually going to be able to pull that off. And this could be a perfect example of something that you can use to point to to show the people that you know what you're doing that could open other opportunities for you as a developer. All right. So that's an overview of Farcaster, you know, a blockchain application that has a pretty widespread appeal that has nothing to do with crypto. Now, at the time of recording this video, of course, most people who are using the application are going to be blockchain native people in the first place. But what I really want to stress is that this has a much wider total addressable market because, you know, almost everybody uses social media. And if you can create a novel application that makes social media better than the existing alternatives with these new types of features, with the values of Web 3.0 social media, then that can give crypto a lasting use case that has nothing to do with financial speculation or getting rich. So let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Have you tried out Farcaster? Are you excited about it? Do you think it could be a big deal use case for crypto? I want to hear from you. And whenever you finish leaving your comment, make sure you smash that like button down below for the YouTube algorithm. Subscribe. And if you want to get ahead of this next crypto wave that's heating up right now, 
then the best thing to do is to double down on your technical skills and become a blockchain developer. And I can show you how to do that step by step, start to finish over at dapuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp. Trust me, you don't have to be an expert to get started today. I've helped people with zero coding experience become real world blockchain developers in a matter of months. So that's all I've got. Until next time, thanks for watching Dap University.